Hi, I'm Joanna Penn from Mystery Thriller TV and today I'm reviewing The Eight by Catherine Neville. Now this is, it's an, quite an old book, it was written in um, 1988 and I found this in a charity bookshop in England and someone actually recommended this to me as an example of a thriller book written by a, a female author and often a lot of the books I review are written by men so uh, I wanted to review this specifically. So The Eight is the story of the Montglain service, which is a chessette um, from the time of Charmaine that contains a secret and a curse that uh, carries across the generations. And the, the chessette is hidden in an, an, an abbey, a convent in France. And the book has two sort of parallel stories. So the first is... Uh, two nuns, cousins, uh, Marais and Valentine, who uh, are, are nuns in this convent and then the convent is broken up and shut down and they are sent with pieces of this chess set uh, to different places in the world. So all the different nuns and the, um, the you know, the, the abbess in charge all take these pieces around the world to try and keep them hidden and prevent the, the secret from being found out. So basically if somebody gets all the pieces and the board, they're going to be able to find out um, this big secret and that's part of uh, the book really is a mystery of what is the secret of the Mont Lane service and each of these pieces has a code on and uh, basically the the book is about various people's hunt for these pieces. So in the past we have uh, these two nuns, Marie and Valentine, uh, they go to Paris to live with their um, their godfather and they meet uh, Talleyrand who is uh, the, uh, a bishop who is also searching and they're very entwined in, in, his, in his life and some of the interesting things about the book are the sort of French historical stuff of which being English I know a little bit um, but certainly find historical fiction interesting and uh, Catherine Neville weaves the historical fiction into the plot nicely so you don't really feel a big jarring between the past and the present which I liked. Um, I enjoyed hearing about the French Revolution I think that's a particularly awful sort of time, the terror, um, which is, you know, quite scary. There's a lot of murder in the book, um, which is good. We like murder. Uh, there's a lot of mystery. I wouldn't call it a thriller because I don't think it's fast paced enough. Um, but it's certainly you know, an interesting mystery in the style of Kate Moss, I think would probably be the closest. Uh, so in the, in the past, we have the two nuns. In the present, we have Catherine Vellis, who is um, sort of an IT consultant working with OPEC, the um, oil lot in the Middle East. She's in Algiers, and she goes to hunt for the pieces over there. Um, her cousin Lily, who I think is one of the most interesting characters in the book, um, is you know, has this little dog, and they have adventures. And then uh, there is the mystery mysterious chess genius uh, from Russia, Solarin, who becomes uh, part of the story as well. So I definitely enjoyed the historical fiction part. I enjoyed the interesting information about chess because I don't particularly know much about chess. I can play chess, but I don't know much about it. And there's a lot of uh, interesting sort of moves in the book and each of the characters becomes like uh, a, ca a piece on the chessboard of life I guess you could say and there's sort of big scale machinations around people maneuvering across the generations so it, it has a big scale um, which in is, is good but also uh, I did find it a little long I think it could have been edited down and I did find myself skipping over a few bits but that doesn't, I certainly read to the end um, because I wanted to find out what the mystery was and what, you know, what happened, basically. What is the secret of the board? So those things will keep you reading. Um, it is a really meaty, chunky book. I definitely recommend it. She has written some more since then, expanding on the story. So it obviously was a, a popular um, book. So recommended, Catherine Neville, The Eight. Uh, I'm Joanna Penn from Mystery Thriller TV.